Hi everyone, welcome to my uh, filler kind of grocery haul. This will actually last me and Ryan about two weeks. I shop a little bit differently when Anthony's not here and he is working out of town. So um, I'll show you guys what I got. I spent $154. I went to um, our local grocery store. I went to our local grocery store, which actually ends up being a little bit more expensive, but it was just more of a convenience thing for me instead of an actual money issue. So, $150? Are you kidding me? You eat a lot. I only asked for one sn snack and you get all of this. All of this. So, I'll show you guys my um, little short filler haul. I'm calling it kind of more like a filler grocery haul because I didn't hardly buy any meat. Um, I already had a lot of meat and I'm trying to do this thing where me and I can cook for me and Ryan and I can make smaller quantities. Um, so I'm actually cooking for us which is more nutritious and um, just in the long run a lot better. Alright guys so I'll show you my filler grocery haul. All right, let's start off with the essentials. I got milk, um, I always get two gallons. I buy organic milk because it lasts a lot longer. Um, just orange juice, this was actually a splurge. I was trying to find cheaper orange juice, but what can you do? Um, just bread and eggs. I like to buy a little bit more of an expensive egg because Ryan eats them almost every day for breakfast. I got some corn tortillas um, for tacos and some flour tortillas. I'm not sure if I planned, kind of got extra flour tortillas. I was I don't exactly have a meal for it, but I do have stuff where I can make a meal for it. Sorry, I had to get on to my child and tell him to go back and finish his homework. Life of a mom, right? With the grocery haul, I got bananas, grapes, and um, blackberries. I really was just craving some of these blackberries, so that's kind of a splurge for me. And also bagels and cream cheese, and that's kind of a splurge for me too because I don't normally get those. Um, I got, Aunt Ryan likes ham sandwiches lately, so I got some ham. I got some sour cream for tacos. I wasn't sure if I had enough cheese, so I just grabbed that thing of shredded cheese. Um, On to the vegetables. I got two things of mushrooms because I make this really good um, pasta and I was craving that and it has mushrooms in it. I got um, zucchini or squash and a zucchini. I really like squash and see how these are like vacuum sealed? They were a, a dollar each but I find that these last a lot longer so if I'm not going to use them right away it's a better deal for me. Let me see if I can show you guys. I got cilantro, I got asparagus, green onions because I was out and I hadn't grown anymore. Um, I usually regrow these if you don't know so I don't buy them all the time. Uh, lemons for my pasta and a couple heads of broccoli because they looked really good in the store. I got um, basil for that pasta that I um, that pasta meal. This is actually really hard to find where I live so I take advantage when I can find it. Um, I got three things of grape tomatoes, mostly for salad, and one for salad, one for a meal, and one for a snack. These were on sale for $1.99, which is actually a really good price. Um, I got an, a head of iceberg lettuce because Ryan likes that with his tacos, and he'll eat salads every night if I make it out of that. I got some hearts of romaine lettuce back there. And these stay good longer and that's why I like to buy those um, and I can mix them together and he has no idea. Um, I got, this is, a new, this is a new thing that I really like, it's um, the Chopped Kit Asian Salad and it comes with the dressing, the nuts and the wontons, but I actually like it for, um, I can make it and eat it for lunches or a snack at night. Um, of course I got carrots because... My family loves carrots. Ryan and Anthony will not let those go to waste. Um, two cucumbers, and I'm gonna try to have Ryan eat these 
for snacks for one and um, the other one for salads during the week. I love pot stickers and I had never tried these so I went ahead and got these because I wanted to try the brand. I got some meatballs because my child loves meatballs. And then this was kind of a weird splurge is I got chicken breasts but I got them in the individually wrapped. I thought for the next couple weeks just me and Ryan that would be a better, easier option for me. A little more expensive but easier. Um, this is kind of a, a splurge, some almond milk, but I like this and for smoothies and different things. And so I really, that's kind of a splurge, but I like it. I was craving coffee and I normally do not crave coffee. I really like Starbucks coffee um, and I like a dark roast or an espresso roast. This was the darkest they had there. It's only 10 K cups and it was actually kind of expensive. And then I got some Coffee Mate to go with it, which is terribly probably unhealthy, but I was just craving having some coffee in the mornings. And I normally don't have those cravings, but when you do, you get some. Uh, I got two things of um, just cheaper Italian dressing because I wanted to try to make Italian chicken that I've seen on YouTube, and I didn't know um, how if one bottle would do, so I got two. This brand actually is the Food Lion brand and it its knockoffs are really cheap like this was only 98 cents and it's usually good quality. They have laundry soap, saltine crackers, like cleaning products. I mean this brand is really good. So if you're if you're in your local Food Lion, this is their Cha-Ching brand and it's a really good deal. And I've found it to be a good um, good for the money too. Um, I got a little thing of Jif. I actually had uh, peanut butter, but I really like peanut butter and apples at night, So, and I like gala apples, so I got some apples. I figure Ryan can eat these for snacks too, but um, I kind of wanted my own peanut butter. It sounds really bad, but sometimes he leaves his, you know, marks in there from making sandwiches and, uh, you know, jelly and all that, so I kind of wanted my own. I got two things of rice or roni, um, just for sides, just in case. This was actually a splurge. It was one of the end caps, and it got me. So I got long, I really like this one, the long grain wild rice. I've always liked this one. And then the chicken and broccoli. Um, Special K, this is my favorite cereal, I love it. And then I got just um, off-brand Cheerios for Ryan, because he was almost out. And this stuff is kind of my splurge stuff. I went ahead and got myself a Rockstar because we have co-op tomorrow. Wasn't sure if I was gonna need it. Got it just in case. I was out of some cleaning products for my Swiffer and I was out of bleach and I obsessively clean my bathrooms with bleach, so. Um, I got, Ryan actually requested these, these shortbread cookies, he calls them striped cookies. And they're an okay price at Food Lion. And I thought he should have those for co-op. I actually got these um, for co-op and I figure for this week and next week at co-op, um, just cause I don't have to worry about having a big huge bag of chips that he will eat up. Um, cause he will eat a bunch of Doritos and then not be hungry. So if I don't watch him, probably us adults do that too. <laughs> Um, I got these uh, pretzels. These were like three for a dollar and I got two things of pretzels because I really wanted to do like a fun project with him and I needed pretzels but I didn't know if I would eat them all so that's why I got just the little bags. Um, I got some fettuccine for this pasta I make. I got some regular spaghetti. I really like using thin spaghetti and then this is my favorite spaghetti sauce, the Classico, the traditional sweet basil. That's my favorite one. Um, I saw this recipe where they did pinto beans and rice. So I got just one pound and this was pretty cheap, like a dollar or something. So if I like it, I'm gonna get it. I actually was gonna do pinto beans, rice, and cornbread. And I forgot the cornbread. What can you do? And I think that brings us around the table. So this is my Oh, and you cannot forget the Diet Coke. And I always have my vacuum on the floor, guys, sorry. 
Um, I'm a Diet Cokeaholic and this keeps me sane as a mom, so, or in life in general. So this is my haul, about $154 worth. Uh, I love sharing grocery hauls with you guys. I'm always really curious what other people buy at the grocery store versus what I buy. And I don't know why um, or what they're making for dinner just because it seems like such a daunting thing making dinner every night. Um, at least for me. So um, I really like sharing this with you guys. And um, if your food preferences aren't these preferences, like you do you, I'll do me, um, we'll still all be healthy and we'll be good. And so I um, appreciate y'all watching and I'll see you again. Bye.